guys my name is Jay Hawkins welcome back to the channel thank you so much for tuning in and coming back please leave me a like share and subscribe this video one like equals one prayer thank you so much uh, for tuning into my channel and stuff I'm gonna be talking about today of WWE reportedly reportingly doing all they can do to sign Kenny Omega I want to know your guys thoughts and opinions on Kenny Omega please leave uh, anything in the comments below I'll be sure to answer them in my next videos uh, below or in the comments in the in the comments below um, I got so inspired and in hearing everything on Twitter uh, by the way you can follow me on Twitter at um, J Jeremy H 2014 1988 or as Jay Hawkins uh, I've been hearing and seeing so much news and rumors on Kenny Omega I just I have to cover this so um, what's the story Kenny Omega is slated to be the biggest free agent once once his contract expires at the end of this month several news outlets have reported that practically every major promotion in the world is trying to say uh, is trying to sign Omega including WWE ringsidenews.com and Russell votes both report that WWE has done all it can do to uh, proceed his talents and that if he doesn't sign, it's not for a lack of trying to sign him. In case you missed it, uh, Kenny Omega has been one of the top stars, of course, of NJPW for the better part for four years. He finally won the IWGP Heavyweight Championship in the middle of last year. He dropped the belt at the Wrestle Kingdom 13 to Hiroshi Tanahashi yesterday. Since his deal with NJPW expires at the end of January, and it is believed that his days with the company are over, with the recent announcement that Elite Wrestling is going ahead with its plans, many have speculated as to whether he will go, go there to re-sign with NJPW or sign with WWE. The heart of the matter a new story comes out daily regarding Omega's potential decision. RingsideNews.com revealed that they have received uh, differing, different reports as to how much was offered to Omega by WWE. Accordingly, it was a lot they had offered him, but that via Wrestle Votes, they have done everything they can to sign him, and if he declines, it's not for a lack of trying. Um, RingsideNews.com also reports that Omega was absent from NJPW's follow-up event to Wrestle Kingdom, New Year's Dash perhaps, signaling that Omega is indeed finished with NJPW. His deal does run through the end of the month, so he could have his rematch for the title before the deal officially runs out. He also might currently be negotiating a new contract, which is why he did not appear at New Year's Dash. The big meeting between ROH, AEW, and NJPW also reportedly happened over the last few days, so perhaps some of what went on in that discussion involved Omega. So what's next? Officially for Omega, he needs to let the days of his current deal with NJPW simply expire. Depending on his intentions, he might announce uh, resigning with the company towards the end of the month or he could join his fellow elite members in all elite wrestling AEW WWE has apparently done everything it could possibly do in order to get him to sign with them but only Omega knows what he truly wants to do if he couldn't get into writing with the promises that were made by WWE and guarantees of character control then he could strongly consider WWE's offer a lot of fans would love to see him in WWE while many of would rather to see him stay out of the promotion because they feel WWE might not book him as well as he should be booked. Whatever Omega decides to do this month, one thing is for sure, the whole world of, profess of professional wrestling will be waiting with bated breath for his decision. So there you have it with Kenny Omega on uh, news and rumors for Kenny. So my thoughts and opinions about this is uh, if Kenny Omega signs to WWE, he most likely will probably go to NXT. But if he gets called to the main roster ASAP, I uh, just better hope that WWE better not screw up 
uh, Kenny Omega and like it said there not book him right and then he's not going to be utilized he's one of the hottest free agents right now so um, my opinion I think he should either just stay with Ring of Honor or just resign with NJPW since he's such a big star already if not uh, cr no correct me if I'm wrong sorry um, correct me on that scratch that I would rather him go with uh, AEW um, with Cody Rhodes and Chris Jericho. It's importantly that Jericho is signed with AEW um, alongside amongst others that are supposedly from WWE are supposedly going to be jumping ship, which I would, could see maybe Tyler Breeze, Ty Dillinger, uh, Zack Ryder. Uh, Zack Ryder, if you guys haven't noticed or follow him on Twitter, he's been saying a lot right now that uh, he's still here and stuff, so he could be a factor to do it. But that's don't quote me on that one. Uh, Kenny Omega it will probably once his co contract expires like any other wrestler he'll probably take a few weeks or days off and take time to think and reflect of what company he wants to sign with and where he wants to go so I think Ken Kenny Omega he's such an awesome superstar I've been watching more of his matches and stuff like that so he's definitely talented and uh, with a shadow of a doubt I know everybody knows about Kenny Omega um, you guys let my let me know about your thoughts and opinions about what do you think Kenny Omega should do or where he should go. Let me let me know in the comments below, uh, or let me know on Twitter. Tweet at me, and I'll I'll definitely respond to your tweets ASAP. So, um, with that said, uh, I believe Kenny Omega. Yeah, uh, as, as I described, he dropped his title and stuff, so he's gonna be done for a while. Once at the end of the month, so. With all uh, elite wrestling coming up, or when they're gonna start and stuff like that, um, I think they're definitely gonna be competition for WWE, of course, because uh, WWE has a lot of uh, rumors here and right now, a lot of talent that are not happy and want to leave. So as soon as that pro promotion goes, I think a lot of WWE superstars are gonna sit back and watch and see how it unfolds first. And if it, to me in my eyes, if it succeeds and it does well they're gonna probably jump ship and maybe go if not sooner so with that said uh, I'll leave it like that at that um, remember to subscribe on the best way to subscribe uh, if not you will soon enough um, thank you guys so much for watching my video I had to make this video ASAP um, I love doing this type of stuff and I got excited to make this video so Please leave me a like, share, and subscribe this video. I will talk to you guys later and hopefully make a video sometime soon next week. Hopefully you guys have been liking these videos that I've been I'm starting to make. So uh, thank you again so much for anybody that's tuning into my channel. Uh, it definitely helps out and supports this channel. So you guys have yourselves a good weekend. So I will talk to you guys later. Peace.